Just for a start of the vid, the first comment on this video is going to get themselves a free mystery box, so congratulations to have won those. But for the other five mystery boxes, I'm going to be giving them away to five random comments. So to enter that giveaway, all you have to do is just like the video, be subscribed to my channel with notifications on, comment your game name on iCov, and finally join my Discord using the link in the description below. And that's pretty much all you have to do to enter. So good luck on that giveaway. Also, guys, I'm currently offering infernal services for people, as you can see on this thread, which I will link in the description below. So as you can see, I only charge 300 more for a regular infernal cape and full bill for a max infernal cape and all the details and requirements can be found on this forum thread so if you're interested in having an infernal cape done on your account then feel free to message me on discord and check out this thread the link to my discord can also be found in the description below so check that out All right, so what I'm probably gonna do now is go for completionist cape. So yeah, we have to start grinding all of these achievements and yeah, there is a lot of achievements. And as well as that, we need to get like each of the next pages and the God War pages like Armadol and Bandos. You can pretty much see all the requirements from this guy over here. Just say you wanna buy completionist cape. So we need to complete all the quests with the achievements, defeat all the champions, so all 10 champion scrolls and create a full Slayer helmet. So yeah, we've got a lot of stuff to do. All right, that's an easy achievement done. Kill 20 chickens. All right, time to craft a sapphire ring. That should be another achievement done. All right. Right, this should be the 20th salmon. <laughs> there we go. Eat 20 salmon. All right, let's pick a banana and um, there we go. Okay, so make 12 spirit pouches. Done. And let's summon a dreadful real quick. Damn, these easy achievements really are easy. I never thought I'd be doing this, but it looks like we're spinning some flex, boys. Go and make that money, but yeah, we need it for an achievement. And there it is. All right, that's another easy one done. All right, there it is. Fish 50 Tinas is done. All right, we gotta be sneaky about this. Still from the wine store. Come on, hide behind that. Done. Jeez, mining pure essence is so quick on here. <laughs> Alright, we actually need to take the Icov tutorial again for some reason. Alright, we actually need to set up a dwarf multi cannon. Alright, time to set up the dwarf multi cannon. Boom. Alright, let's buy ourselves a PK set. Gotta be cheap. <laughs> there we go. Alright, we just entered our bank pin. We've just checked today's best time, which is 57 seconds on Zora. Damn. Alright, <laughs> we need to sell an item, so might as well put in a whip for 1 GP. Let's see how quickly this gets sold. <laughs> and it's gone. Someone bought it, but it got us an achievement done. Alright, I'm not too sure how to catch a bunny at the moment, so I'll probably leave that one, but we can exchange a pouch for shards. Time to learn about the donation benefits from this guy. Damn, that Uber donator looks pretty juicy, not gonna lie. Alright, we just entered someone's house. Alright, this one's a bit risky. We have to pull the edge of a Walter. Hopefully we don't get TB'd. I mean, we don't really have anything, but I don't want to die, bro. All right, there's no one here. Good. All right, let's catch ourselves an implant. Come over here, mister. Oh, damn, that's two achievements done. All right, let's make a tiara. All right, that's pretty much like all of these achievements done. Like, the only ones left to do are catch a bunny and participate in a Soul Wars game. So we need to wait for Soul Wars to actually be active for that. So I'll probably do that when there's a Soul Wars event. Oh, God, kill a Revenant. That's going to be tough. It's probably going to be camped. I'm not going to lie. All right, nice. We managed to kill one. No, dude. God damn it. <laughs> Shout out to Mrs. Psychic Clown. He helped me with a team dungeon, so that's another raid complete. All right, next one's to defeat a Dagonoth Mother, and I'm pretty sure to do that, we actually need to complete the quest. Far from the deep, so Slayer teleports Lighthouse. Let's go. All right, good fight, Mr. Dagonoth Mother. Quest complete. Now we need to pickpocket 50 Master Farmers. Jeez, it's gonna take a while. All right, nice. Pickpocket 50 Master Farmers. All right, there we go. We just summoned 20 Familiars. All right, shout out to her. He's actually letting me kill him for the FTP Arena achievement, so this guy actually makes a lot of my thumbnails so feel free to check him out. I've linked his rune server thread in the description below and he makes some really good graphics so go check that out and um, yeah shout out to him. All right there we go we just killed him. <laughs> There's the achievement done. All right I'm pretty sure we just used the cape on him to upgrade it and there we go upgraded skill cape. All right let's buy a lottery ticket hopefully we win come on. RIP 7 more cash. All right we just used a bull rush scroll that's another achievement done. All right that should be a KBD about to be defeated come on. Let's get a visage on our first drop. Killer King Black Dragon. Aw oh, nothing special. All right that should be us making a Sarad Omen brew. Right, we need to buy something to tackle. Might as well be this. I don't know what it is, but <laughs> achievement done. All right, so I've actually figured out how to catch a bunny. So basically what you need to do first is you actually need to catch a ferret. So one of these things. And you do need 27 hunter, by the way, but <laughs> I've got 99, so all good. All right, there it is. And next, we basically have to put a rabbit snare outside one of these holes and then use a ferret on the rabbit hole. There it is. <laughs> Thanks to the raw rabbit. All right, so one of the achievements is actually to fill a medium pouch with the essence. So we've got a small pouch at the moment. Hopefully these give us the other three. All all right, so we've literally got like every pouch apart from the medium pouch, for God's sake. I think these might actually be tradable, so once my overload runs out, I might see if I can buy one from the player and shops, but if not, I'm gonna have to keep camping these. All right, nice, there we go. Finally, that took 
us so long, literally. Look how many like pouches we got before we actually got that. Oh my god, that took such a long amount of time. But there we go, finally, medium pouch. That should be achievement done. There we go. Right, next up we have to make an admiral pie. So this is actually very complicated. So you have to use the empty bucket on the sink to get a bucket of water, then use it with a pot of flour which you get from there to make pastry dough. And then you use that on the pie shell, and then you use the salmon on the pie shell, then the tuna, and finally the potato. And that'll be a raw admiral pie. We better not burn this. We are 99 cooking, but come on. <laughs> nice, there's the achievement done. All right, next up we have to make a baked potato with tuna and sweet corn. So you can buy most of this stuff from this guy. I believe, first of all, you have to cook the potato, and then you use a pat of butter on it to make a potato with butter. Then you use the tuna with the bowl. And then you have to use the sweet corn on the range to cook it, basically. And finally, you use that cooked sweet corn with the tuna and corn. And then you finally use that on the potato to make a tuna potato. So there's a lot of steps to that. All right, next up, we need to build a telescope. So for that, we actually need a study, which unfortunately costs 7 mil, rest in peace. But now we can build a telescope. There it is, build a telescope. All right, so I managed to buy some dragon bolt tips in the player and stores, but the next achievement is to actually add bolt tips to 500 bolt. Um, yeah, there's no actual runeite bolts in the store, so I'm gonna have to make them myself. All right, that should be 500 bolts made, nice. Renek 20 actually let me kill him. <laughs> Killer player in any carnival's pool, done. All right, pick 10 flowers from Mythor Seeds has also been done. Right, we should be able to bank, and there we go. <laughs> right, we just claimed all our god books from Jossic, but we actually need to preach from one of them in order to complete an achievement. That's another one done. All right, there we go, guys. Finally, we completed 100 laps of the Wadi course, so yeah, I decided to do that to get some marks of grace so I can buy some graceful pieces. And yeah, we actually did bank earlier, so I said we have around 90 marks of grace right now, but yeah, there's so many people in the wilderness right now. So I'm just gonna buy the gloves, which is an achievement done, and then I can just recolor it. Probably gonna go with gold. All right, awesome. So yeah, that's another medium achievement done. All right, next achievement is to craft a tiara. So I think that should be it. All right, nice. Whoa, 5k free earrings, I'll take them. We actually just completed the achievement to fish 500 monkfish, so that actually took a while. So voting actually just got released today, so yeah, I think you can only vote for two websites, so we currently have two vote points, and I'm gonna buy myself a frozen key with that, so that's another achievement done. Boys, we just won ourselves a game of Riot Wars, so we didn't even need to win it, we just had to play it, but thought I might as well win, so we came with some pretty good gear. All right, let's see what we get as the prize. Vesta's longsword, not bad. There was an achievement to beat the Riot Wars. All right, not bad. All right, nice, we just finished the achievement to mine 100 runite ores in the wilderness resource area so yeah we might as well keep going because another achievement is to mine 300 runite ores so it's still got like another 190 to go and yeah these seem to be the quickest way to mine runite ores and they gave like really good xp because they're in the wilderness resource area so yeah i'm gonna keep staying here all right it's been a grind but we finally got the achievement to mine 300 runite ores so that's another achievement done all right let's go in <laughs> Dude, I'm actually so nervous, holy shit. Okay, triple jazz time, fuck me. Fuck, did I not get the healers? They keep doing different ones, give me a break, bro! <laughs> Thank you. 
Come on. Come on. <laughs> no, 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 no. Bro, what the fuck? Ah! What the fuck? Imagine for the fuck? <laughs> Norman Inferno plus 10 strength bonus Max Inferno Pog Champ. I hope you enjoyed that episode. We did get quite a lot of progress done, and if you haven't tried out Ikov already, then definitely make sure to. It's like 3 p.m. on a Thursday or something. There's over 800 people online, and like I said in the weekends, it usually hits at least 1,500 plus online, which is crazy for a private server. Ikov is currently by far the biggest private server out right now. The link to Ikov and its Discord are both found in the description below. Make sure to join them both. And now I'm gonna pick the giveaway results from the previous video. So good luck to everyone. All right, it's now time to pick the five winners from the previous video. So 257 unique users that's crazy but the first winner is working out second winner is bram says i like cheese <laughs> congrats dude third winner is bad choice fourth winner is huge erection um okay interesting name and our fifth and final winner is mighty four so congratulations to those five guys to claim your prizes just pm me on discord the link to my discord can be found in the description below and there's over like 1300 people in there it is a massive discord and it's a really cool place to shout out in and i do loads of giveaways in there as well and yeah thanks for watching guys and i'll see you next time